we finally have, after quite a few years, some good news. Remember that old game, Little League Planet Hub, that would have been a free-to-play game, that would have basically been the community levels feature on steroids, that was sadly cancelled. The first eight minutes of gameplay were leaked. I'm going to watch it for the first time with all of you. Stephen Fry's back, guys. You can quite easily cross potentially fun-stopping obstacles with a mere tap of the action button. Just like any Little League Planet game, it seems that was stuck off of a tutorial where they tell you the obvious, just in case you've never played a video game before in your entire life. Whoever's idea it was to not pay the money to hire him again for Saba is an idiot and should be fired immediately. <laughs> It looks like for LBP Hub, we would have had a seaside theme. Does that remind you of anything? Here we have a few different costumes. I wonder if these costumes were in LBP 3. I think this one was. Not sure about the other three. Yo, look at this crab right here. They even made the biceps. This game was originally going to be all about the create mode. So it makes sense that we start off with a lot of different prize bubbles. We have our first cutscene for the game. And someone died. Who died? Was it the LBP franchise? Is that what died? It's a shame that LBP Hub would have came out and clearly they had already built most of the game and they decided to rework it into Louis Planet 3 for some reason. It doesn't actually look any better than LBP 3 because let's be honest with ourselves. If LBP 3 wasn't really buggy, glitchy and annoying, it would have been a very, very solid game. I was always under the impression that LBP is a game that really should have just been one singular game that kept on getting content updates. Kind of like Fortnite or Minecraft. We have challenges. Don't know what those are. Yo, that guy's on steroids! So this seems like it would have been one of the new features of Little League Planet Hub, these challenges, which once again, I'm pretty sure LWP3 did have some challenges. So it does seem like, once again, this is a feature that was sort of copied into LBP3 and changed slightly. So you would have been able to create your own challenges. That's very interesting. But again, that doesn't seem very different from just creating your own community levels. Oh, so you would have your previous time would be the ghost or your friend's time and your goal is to beat them. But so far, this challenge looks like a lot of fun. It does look very similar to all the challenges we did get. I'm triggered. Bro, he has missed too many prize bubbles. They were literally right there, bro. Oh, that's nice. But they got the pod. The pod is back. In Saba, you have these shitty little world maps. The pod would have been infinitely better. But that is the end of the leaked gameplay that was posted. If you haven't seen it somehow, make sure to check out Blazing Victini's video on the subject. But that is the end of this video. Thank you very much for watching. And I will see you all in the next one. Goodbye, everybody.